Hello, in today's video, we are going to show you how to replace a root site in SharePoint Online. The root site will be proficient automatically when your organization set up a Microsoft 365 or Microsoft 365 plan that includes SharePoint. The default URL of this root site will be in a format that starts with your company name followed by SharePoint.com. For example, our company name is Doc365. So our root site uh, address URL is doc365.sharepoint.com. It will be named communication site by default and all global admins in your organization will be owners of this root site. Note that the root site cannot be connected to a Microsoft 365 group. So let me show you how you can replace a root site in SharePoint Online. This is my uh, Office 365 start page. So let's go to the SharePoint platform from here. I'm clicking on the SharePoint option. So this is my SharePoint uh, start page. So first of all, uh, it is from the SharePoint uh, admin center. You can change the root site. So uh, let's go to the admin center. Uh, I'm clicking on the app launcher again and choose admin. This is the Microsoft 365 admin center. From here, you need to choose SharePoint admin center. So I'm clicking on show all on the side and under admin centers, you will find SharePoint here. You can click on this pin icon to pin it at the top if you used to access it uh, frequently. So click on SharePoint and the SharePoint admin center uh, will be open and under sites click on active sites so that all sites in your organization uh, will be uh, listed here so first uh, let's just uh, sort this list in a to z a to z uh, format or filter so when you do this uh, your root site will be listed first. So in this case, the landing uh, is the root site here. So uh, this is actually a Microsoft 365 demo account or a test account. We use this for uh, tutorial purposes. So uh, after finding the root site, just uh, check this uh, option or choose that site and click on the ellipses at the bottom for more options and choose replace site. So here uh, you can uh, enter a new URL if you have a uh, new site which can be assigned as root site for your organization you can enter it here and click on save. So that uh, so that's the process you need to uh, follow for replacing the root site for your SharePoint online. I am not actually uh, updating the link here for now, but this is the procedure. So it might take up to two hours to uh, apply this change. And you can also check this uh, when next time you uh, log into your uh, SharePoint. So that's how you can replace the root site in SharePoint online. Remember, you cannot delete a root site, but you can always replace a root site like this. Uh, try this and leave a like if you find this video useful. We would like to hear from you in the form of comments below this video. Have a good day. We will see you with another interesting video soon.